Oh, here's a cool moment. Yeah, Allen Iverson's one. reaction to seeing a poster of him and Kobe. Uh, the anniversary of Kobe Bryant's death happened recently. Uh, obviously, a uh, very uh, iconic figure. Meant a lot to a lot of people, including apparently Allen Iverson. He seems to be at some sort of a, an event signing memorabilia. And somebody approaches him with a photograph of himself and Kobe Bryant. And he gets kind of caught off guard. Go ahead and play it. Who is this? From 10 o'clock to 1.30. Sure. It was Candy, remember? Where you want me to sign this at? Man, you gonna give me one? You got another one from me? I got it over there by Fetterman. Man, I need one of these. So to him. Well, um, where you want it? Up the top? Why ain't you get, um, um, a white joint. Do that. Yes. Let me go. I can go grab another one off the table. Can I put something up here for him? Put whatever you want. It's my job to be the bad guy. You can be the good guy anytime you want. <laughs> can I put something up here? Yeah. So he goes on. He goes on to write something extra, and he's like so compelled. It's one of these moments that many people have probably experienced where you don't expect to be caught off guard. You're kind of going through the process. I presume he signed like dozens of mm. different things. And then he was, somebody came up with this combo photo of him and Kobe. And then he thought about Kobe and he was just kind of uh, it, it back. like a little bit shocked. And also he really wanted the photo for himself, but who knows? He probably had a vivid memory of that exact moment. And then he goes on to write something extra after signing it. I'm not sure what he felt uh, compelled to write, but he didn't want to let the photo go. He didn't want to just give it to the guy. He goes, he goes, where did you get this? Can I have one of these? He didn't really want to finish. He kind of wanted to stay in the presence of uh, the photo. And it's a couple of things going on. What? Well, come on, man. What are you doing here? You're spoiling the sentimental <laughs> moment, man. It's, a, it's one of those things where it's twofold, where there's the recollection and memory of Kobe, but then also the past career of an individual like Allen Iverson, who's uh, uh, like recognizing a moment in his life when he's at his prime. Mm -hmm. And I can't tell what the guy asking for the signature said, but it sounded like he said he was scared of you. Did you hear that part somewhere at the beginning? Maybe you guys really? can interpret this better than me. Just play this part. It was handy, remember? Right there. Did he say he was scared of you, remember? Oh, Kobe. Yeah. Kobe yeah. was scared of him, yeah. That's what he said, right? Mm -hmm. It's cool, man. Mm -hmm. Anyway, whatever moments caption in that photo means something to Allen Iverson, I'm sure he was able to get his own uh, copy of it. And it's just a candid moment, an unusual moment. And uh, people yeah. want to see the Coke video the next time. No, they stop it. <laughs> Come on, there's enough of that on the internet. I don't need to bring you that. I don't need to show you that. We got lots to show you. We've been doing this. We're going to keep doing it. It's an incredible streak that's going on right now. Shout out Willie Do. Shout out everybody in the chat. Shout out Jack. Shout out Casper. Shout out Marissa. Shout out Otis. It's a lot of sleeping dogs. You know what they say about sleeping dogs? Let them lie. You let them lie. That's right. Oh, thanks for the super chats and support, everybody. Everybody in the comments, Jack sees it. He lets me know. Yep. Thank you.